My name is Eric Peterson and uh, I've been in the engineering side of things since like 2011. I got into this situation with the heart of racing because of my relationship with Ian James. That's what led me here, but I've done everything from IndyCar to Spec Z, all the way from the top to the, to the bottom, really, a little bit of everything. Okay, boxes, black boxes, black tires. Coming into the new team, I try not to do too much of anything other than to try to sit back and absorb and, and learn how the team operates, how they get about and do their business. They do a very good job. They've obviously been very successful. They're in the hunt for the championship. So a second car situation is tricky. You, you try not to take away from that focus because the 23 team needs to have that focus. They deserve it. The role is to not try to interfere too much. Keep yourself organized enough so that you are out of their head and you won't take away from any of their resources, and then you can help them. feels like I'm back home. Obviously, time in New Zealand was one and a half years of my life that I will never forget. Who would have said all of a sudden this the entire world shuts down and you find yourself in the safest country in the world? As the days went by, I just felt like homesick, even though my home is, is Spain. But as much as I enjoyed my time in New Zealand, every single time I watched the Nimsa race from the couch, it was hard. It was awesome at the same time because I was so proud of the, of the whole team of how they were improving, evolving, finding their, their groove and the mo their mojo. It was spectacular to witness, but it felt like I needed to be here. This is where I belong. To finally be in this balance, it feels like home. We missed him. We missed him as a team leaving, but now he, he's, he's back in America. He's super excited to be back on, on the team. Gabe and myself made that commitment that you know, when he would be back, there'd be a place for him. That meant going to two cars. With Ross and Roman having great momentum and great chemistry, running high in the championship, we, we were never going to take that away from them because they've deserved that ride. Stay in line. No overtake until start finish line. Ready, ready, green, green, green. Your tire's coming off the beat back there. You're probably going to need to be loaded.
Realities are that there's no guarantees. No one ever wants to come to a track and don't want this to happen. Reality is it is going to happen at yeah. some point. You know, you just want to minimize the brutality of it <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> well, it felt, felt pretty brutal today. You have to have a lot of passion, but you also have to have a lot of reality. You can't get too high and you can't get too low. It's racing, it is what it is. <laughs> 